When embarking on creating this show, we knew that we wanted to combine the elements of burlesque and the grotesque, comedy and cabaret, magic and horror, to explore the darker and lighter sides of visual impairment and sexuality. Pity the surgery didn't work on my eyes, eh? Oh, there it is. I perch one bottle. I place the finger of my elegant surgical glove in my teeth. And I pull. I pull. Uh, uh, ow! <laughs> Look, I don't know what's going on here. I just want to get out. But you are part of the experiment, my dear. What experiment? The testing of an amazing new invention, the sheer red. Naturally, my next step was to test it on humans, and I predicted that what would be revealed would be that they're true fantasies of themselves. <laughs> I pull apart the dark waves to emerge. But which parts of myself should I cover up? Or reveal? Arms out. I wish to feel free. Oblivious of the sheer ray shining on them, the three presenters had transformed into grotesque and occasionally humorous parodies of sexuality. All there is is half mats, nipple tassels, knickers, suspenders, white tubes, gloves, and back. Does the same with two great and size balloons and completes his muzzle look like triumphantly holding two cannonball size balloons over his head before stuffing them in at the top of his arm. I flex by triceps, biceps, and not forgetting those fake girls. Arms that could hold you. Hold you. Arms that could hold you down. <laughs> also, tactile special effects are used in the dark to stimulate a palpable sense of place and narrative, and these are designed to literally reach out and touch the audience. <laughs> 